Can you tell me, Derek, about when you were in the army cadets in the war? Yeah, well, the, uh, the army cadets were formed after the war broke out. I don't know who formed them or why they were formed. There was, there was the Home Guard in Perton. That was sort of local people, which were, well, they were formed. In, in, they, the idea was that the Germans were going to attack us any minute and, and, and local people were, had their own guns, 12 boards, and the Home Guard was formed. And then the army cadets were formed. Now, I don't know if it was a, the government idea to form an army cadets we were all young lads from about 13 or 14 and there was Purton army cadets and there was Hitchin army cadets and I don't and Letch was army cadets but I, I can't think of any other village that had their own army cadets apart from Purton the Purton army cadets was run was was run by Bill Pryor from Holwell now he was an ex-soldier and I think he was a regimental sergeant major during the during his time in the army and he took over army Purton army cadets and trained us we were the, i suppose the idea was we were being trained ready to go into the regular army when we got older and we had we had wooden rifles to start with because i suppose there weren't enough rifles to go around now that otherwise but um they were all boys from Purton and Holwell about my age which was about Four to thirteen, fourteen. And where did you meet? Well, we met. I, I, I know we used to do our, our drilling because uh, uh, Bill Pryor, the, <laughs> the, in charge, he, he was very good at teaching us how to march and present arms and slope arms and all that caper. And and I, I, and I, we did that in the Purton School playground. And I know we used to meet in the. There was a big. Well, it was our ex-army huts at the back of Purton Court, Mr. Martineau's place, and I know we used to meet in there in the week, and we used to do our marching and, and sort of other bits and bobs on a Sunday morning. And I, well, it's a job to say what we, well, what were we doing any good? I don't know whether we were or not. But the idea was to train us to be soldiers, I think. Yeah. And did you take part in any practices or manoeuvres or anything like oh, that? Oh, yeah, there was regular... The Home Guard had manoeuvres, what they call the manoeuvres. That was a... They, they defended a certain spot and, and Hitchin Home Guard had to try and capture it. And I know we, we, were, we, had to, we were joined them at different times. And, and I know one time Hitchin Army cadets were, were defending... The small hold in 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 Hexton Road, but uh, uh, Arthur Burton kept it then, and we got to try and capture it. The Burton Army cadets and Bob Kingsley and I, Bob Kingsley was my mate. We were put in charge of our, our lot to to arrange the, how we were going to do it, how we were going to creep up on them and capture it, and, because we got dummy guns like wooden guns, and and I, I think we got, if I remember, we got firecrackers or something to make a noise if I I think it was something with a, on a string that you pulled but I probably tied it to your rifle I don't know uh, you see we're going back now 60 70 years you were asking me to think of something that I, I could have told you better years ago but, but I know we we um we beat our we how we beat them we were in charge Bob because we've got to try and capture uh that small holding and the hitching army cadets were defending it. Well, what we did that was on a Sunday morning. We went on, on a Saturday afternoon. We went up to Arthur Burton's and we took his horse and cart and took it to Orton Head Farm, which was Mr. Moss' farm there then. And we le on a, on the Sunday morning we left the horse and cart there Saturday night. And Sunday morning we went up about there was about six of us, and we sat in the got in the cart, and two of us two of them. Well, I was in the cart, I remember it ever so well. Bob Bob was in the cart with Bob Kingsley. And they put hurdles, sheep hurdles over the top of the cart. And, and they loaded straw on top of that. So that it looked like a it looked like a cartload of straw. And then we got Bob Kingsley's younger brother to lead the horse and cart on the Sunday morning from the Moss's farm, along the Hexton Road. 
and we turned in, uh, and I can remember uh, as we went by Hand Post Corner, put what we call Perton Cross on the old, where it wibbly wobbly lane meets for the Perton Road. And I, I remember we were creeping out of the cart, we were in the bottom, and, and the army, hitching army cadets were, were laying in the ditches there waiting for us to attack us. And they thought we were going to creep up the ditches and, and to try and capture this farm. But we walked past them, and the, he led the horse into Arthur Burton's. And we got out of the army. We, we got out of the cart, and we captured their 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 captain and colonel and everything. And we took over the farm, and we were in charge. And they were outside and trying to stop us. <laughs> so we won the battle there. And I don't know. That was all part of manoeuvres. There, there was there was manoeuvres taking place all the time. And I remember we went with the home guard once to try and capture Henlow Camp when they. That there was army uh, home guards defending that. That was all part of the training of to be a to be a soldier, I suppose. I don't know whether thinking about it now it was a damn waste of time, really. <laughs> but uh, somebody thought it was a good idea. <laughs> I know, so we were issued. We had all uniforms and everything. And, and Burton Army Cadets, uh, Bill Pryor in charge, he, he, was, he was an expert our regimental sergeant major, and he was brilliant. He could he could march a, a platoon and turn them round on the six foot and and hold them and present arms and shoulder arms and slope arms. And all, I can remember all that. Stand at ease, stand easy, you know. And, and we were so good. We went. We went. We gave exhibitions. I, I, I remember giving an exhibition on St Mary's Square at Hitchin to the army, to Hitchin Army Cadets and the Hitchin Home Guard. You know, Perth <laughs> got a great reputation. We were, we were, we were, we were good. Believe it or not, we were, we were, we were the good. Yeah, yeah, we were the th right ones. Yeah, yeah.